बुक सेवन द बुक ऑफ योग कैन टू सिक्स निर्वाना एंड द ऑल निगेटिंग एप्सल्यूट पेज फाइव फोर्टी एट सेकेंड लाइन येट इटर्निटी एंड इन्फिनिटी सीन बट वर्ड्स vainly affixed by mind's incompetence to its stupendous lone reality the world is but a spark burst from its light all moments flashes from its timelessness all objects glimmerings of the bodyless that disappear from mind when that is seen it held as if a shield before its face a consciousness that saw without a seer the truth where knowledge is not nor nor not known the love enarmed of its own delight in which the lover is not nor the beloved bringing their personal passion into the vast the force omnipotent in quietude the bliss that none can ever hope to taste it cancel the convincing cheat of self a truth in nothingness was its mighty clue if all existence could renounce to be and being take refuge in non being's arms and non being could strike out its ciphered round some lusher of that reality might appear a formless liberation keen on her one sepulcher alive in brain and flesh she had risen up from body mind and life she was no more a person in a world she had escaped into infinity what once had been herself had disappeared there was no frame of things no figure of soul a refugee from the domain of sense evading the necessity of thought delivered from knowledge and from ignorance and rescued from the true and the untrue she shared the superconscious high retreat beyond the self born word the nude idea the first spare solid ground of consciousness beings were not there existence had no place there was no temptation of the joy to be unutterably effaced no one and null a vanishing vestige like a violet trace a faint record merely of a self now past she was a point in the unknowable only some last annulment now remained an illusion's vague indefinable step a memory of being still was there and kept her separate from nothingness she was in that but still became not that the shadow of herself so close to not could be again self's point up we to live return out of the inconceivable and be what some mysterious vast might choose even as the unknowable decreed she might be not or new become the all or if the omnipotent nihil took a shape emerge as someone and redeem the world even she might learn what the mystic cipher held the seeming exit or closed end of all could be a blind tenebrous passage screen from sight her state the eclipsing shell of a darkened sun on its secret way to the ineffable even now her splendid being might fling back 
out of the silence and the nullity a gleaming portion of the all wonderful a part of some all affirming absolute a shining mirror of the eternal truth to show to the one in all its manifest face to the souls of men their deep identity or she might wake into god's quietude beyond the cosmic day and cosmic night and rest appeased in his white eternity but this was now unreal or remote or covered in the mystic fathomless blank in infinite nothingness was the ultimate sign or else the real was the unknowable a lonely absolute negated all it effaced the ignorant world from its solitude and drowned the soul in its everlasting peace end of canto 6 Oh, my God.